Alright, what we're going to do today is I'm going to show you the, the Media Mall play on, well, Media Mall makes play on their Wii interface for their software called Play On. I'm going to be showing you that. So, of course, you need to have the, the Wii browser, which I'm loading up now. Click on my favorites. Click on play on. And it wants to make sure that you uh, have the full screen view so you don't have the uh, the bar at the bottom always popping up. It's almost as if like it makes you before it'll load up, but it'll load up anyway. Alright, once you have it set up on your machine, it's running as a, uh, a local media server. Don't ask why mine is called Edna WHS. Well, WHS is for Windows Home Server. Alright, so here's the interface. You got Netflix, Amazon, Hulu. And I'm pretty sure if you've gotten to YouTube and are watching this, you can read. So I'll need to read all those off to you. Uh, Food Network, of course. Um, one thing I should explain is um, in Play On, initially, when you're setting it up, it's set up for Netflix, assuming you have an instant streaming account and Hulu, I mean Hulu and Amazon and YouTube. But you, it's not YouTube where you can just search for a name and it comes up. This is YouTube where if you put in specific usernames, it will pull in all the uploaded content from those usernames. It also have stuff that's like the top 100 and things like that as well. I'll show you real fast. So it's most popular, most recent. And I only put in my own, which is kind of, you know, piping myself up, but I'm comfortable with that. Uh, I only put my own username in, just to make sure everything was working, see some of the videos that I put up there, so, uh, you know. Yep, and it does do this sometimes, it's not perfect, so you have to be patient with it. It is beta, beta code in the latest release of uh, Play On. But as you can see, it does play. So you can move it around the way you would any other web page. So that's the oh, oh, oh. I guess Rick Lee. I don't know. Anyway, uh, click home and go back to all the various options you have here. Um, I put up another uh, play on video I had a, like a maybe a 5 or 6 second clip of Family Guy in it and it got taken down because obviously I'm not the you know the rights holder to that so I'm going to be showing you stuff that I have the rights to show so this video won't get taken down as well of course because I'm trying to show this it's going to take forever to load uh, such is life Okay, um, I think I have 300 and something movies in my Netflix queue. Uh, let's click on comedy. Let that load up. And you can see here, I have a bunch of movies that I can scroll through and you click on them and they will play. I can probably get away with just showing, you know, just a second or something, but I'm pretty sure I won't get in trouble for that. I'm not going to show any of the actual film. It'll just be, you know, the studio or whatever who produced it coming up, and then I'll stop it once it decides to load up. Now, I believe they are coming out with a more official, uh, official um, interface for people to access uh, Netflix and other content on their Wii's but you know, until that gets here you have to ask yourself is it worth $40? I don't know um, because you can get so much other content I'm going to say yeah but you know it's all a matter of opinion I 
I should mention that my Wii is wired, so that may make it run a little better than if it was running wirelessly. Perfect, which it's not gonna be. Um, that may be one of the reasons why. But as you can see, it does stream movies in, and you have access to your old queue. I don't have Amazon set up. Uh, Hulu, we all know what Hulu looks like. Basically, if you go to uh, unofficial play on plugs. They have a bunch of unofficial plugs, plugins, excuse me, for CBS and uh, no, these may be part of it, excuse me, like ESPN, Academic Earth, which has some good uh, Stanford um, lectures and classes and stuff up there, Adult Swim, Crackle, I don't know what that is, Food Network has full episodes, South Park, Spike, you have a whole bunch of stuff. Our Vision 3 is an official uh, plugin, so that will work swimmingly. Uh, uh, being official and all, it's updated fairly frequently. Uh, podcast just kind of gives you access to a whole bunch of different sites, little clips, and so you see HBO and G4. But there aren't really full episodes of anything. I haven't checked out everything on this list. Uh, you can get Onion News Network videos, which is great. Um, PBS stuff is good. I haven't really checked out MTV, but at some point I will. And they also have beta code in the new release for shared media so media you, you're running uh, locally and, mm, I did add the folders but apparently they do not wish to be recognized so mm, go figure somebody made a plugin to do that but uh, wait a minute which is which this is it. I guess that's not working out right. I don't know why. I did add uh, my content. Uh, hmm. Showing zero results. Oh well. Um, well, that basically shows you uh, the play on interface that you use of the Wii web browser and that's pretty much it <laughs>